guys, I hope everyone had a fantastic Christmas, those who were celebrating. Me and my family had a great Christmas. I really enjoyed um, the holidays and spending time with them. Um, as you can see from the title of this video, this is a what I got for Christmas video. This was um, suggested by Amanda from Amanda and Lola Newfoundland. Um, if you guys want to check out her channel, I will link her down below. Amanda, thank you for uh, requesting this video. Um, this will be a very fun video to do. Um, keep in mind, I'm not going to show every single Christmas present that I got because a lot of the stuff that I got was like gift certificates, money, or they were really big and I'll try to remember to take pictures and insert them when I'm editing, but I may forget. Um, so I'm just kind of showing you the stuff that's a little bit smaller, easier to bring upstairs because I film in my bedroom. And uh, yeah, so the first thing that I got was um, a candle from my mom. And this is one that I really liked. She had gotten it and in the fall, I believe. And I said that I really liked it, so she went and got me one for Christmas. This is from Bath & Body Works. This is Marshmallow Fireside. This smells so good. It smells like marshmallows, but like if you're roasting them right over the fire. But then it also has kind of like a... Kind of smells like cologne almost. It definitely smells like, you know when you're, when you're roasting marshmallows and they kind of get like almost burnt but not completely burnt? They're just like, I don't know how to explain it. Like it doesn't smell overly sweet. Like it's like a grown up version of like toasted marshmallow if that makes any sense. So this is a three wick so that'll last me quite a while. I think they're supposed to last for 50 hours? I don't know. This will last me a while. The next thing that I got was another thing from my mom. This is This one is a little bit more you know, sentimental and serious. Um, this is a little ornament that I got. My sister also got one as well. And it's a little angel and it has a pearl on it and underneath it says, bless my dad. Um, about a little bit over two years ago, I uh, lost my dad uh, very suddenly. So yeah, it's definitely been really hard and uh, since it was very sudden, yeah, it's been it's been really hard to deal with and to cope with, but this is just kind of a nice little, you know, memento, you know, to kind of, you know, since my dad obviously can't, isn't here to celebrate Christmas with us and he always really liked Christmas. Um, this was just really special and she got it in pearls because I just, I love pearls. My sister got one, I believe, that had like rhinestones all over it because she's more into that, but that was a really special gift from my mom. But more gifts that I got from my mom, I think she just won kind of on like a candle slash like scent craze for all my gifts. Um, she got me a Scentsy last year. I really, really like it. It's a mint green. It's probably mm, this big and it looks like a mason jar. It's really cute. I really like it. Um, and so she got me some more scents. So these are actually from Yankee Candle. They're not this Scentsy brand, but they still work the same. I find though that, because I have one um, that she got me in my Scentsy right now, I find they're a little bit too big for the one, the certain model that I have. So I might like next time I use them, I might just cut it in half because I find that I'll have it on for a few hours and the actual wax will never fully melt. You know, half of it will only be melted, but it still smells really good. The one that I have um, in my Scentsy right now is Vanilla Cupcake. Which smells really, really good. This one is Soft Blanket. And then she got me another one called Clean Cotton. And then another one is Home Sweet Home. Excited to try that one. And then, of course, I got a whole bunch of other stuff from my mom. I got, well, from everyone. We got tons and tons of chocolate, and I just didn't really feel it necessary to, you know, lug it all upstairs. And, you know, it's chocolate. It's not that. It's fantastic, but, you know, like, everyone gets chocolate. I don't think I need to show every little gift that I got. Um, another thing that I got uh, from my mom was I got like napkins, um, just like little things like that that I didn't, just didn't feel like that I needed to show in this video because the video would probably be a half an hour and I don't want it to be a half an hour. So moving on, another thing or another gift that I got, these are from my sister. So uh, my husband and I, we got a gift certificate to go out for supper and then she gave me more sensey stuff. So I ha I'm like set for like a few years. It's awesome. And like they gave me a whole like mixture of scents. So I have scents for like all the four seasons. It's pretty awesome. So this one is definitely more for, uh, I was going to say Christmas, <laughs> more for spring, summer. This is uh, Tropical Fiesta. And these kind of look like ice cubes. So you just break one off. And these are better, uh, this is a better uh, amount for my scents, yeah, I find. I'm just going to smell it for you. 
And this just smells, yeah, very tropical, like the name says. Pineapple, um, strawberries, kiwis, mangoes. Really, really like that. This next one is also a summer spring scent. This is Pineapple Palm. And I believe she got these at Walmart. These aren't the Scentsy uh, brand, but you don't need to like buy Scentsy because it is a little bit more expensive. This definitely smells like pineapple, but it also has like a floral scent to it, which I kind of like. The next one she got me was Toasted Pecan Fudge, which I'm really, really excited about because I really like warm, sugary um, scents. Yeah, this smells really, really warm. Um, I can't really smell pecans, but it definitely smells warm and nutty and chocolatey. So that one I'll probably be using very shortly. So another gift that I received that I'm just not going to show because it's hooked up to our computer is my husband and I, we decided to buy a Mac Mini. He's a computer programmer, so he really wants to make apps for, you know, the iPhone. But in order to do that, you need to have a Mac. And my uh, MacBook, I love it to death, but it's five years old, and I just refuse to update it because that, it's just too big of an update now. <laughs> um, so we decided to get just a little Mac Mini, and we got our monitor. So again, I'm not going to show that because it's already hooked up. I might take a picture, um, but yeah, it's just a computer, but we got a nice big 27 uh, inch monitor so now um, I'm that's it's actually going to be my computer he's just gonna use it to uh, make apps on because he he says he hates Macs he's really big into PCs um, but yeah it's gonna be really really nice to edit on is what I'm trying to say so that's like the big gift that we gave to ourselves um, well actually no that's the second biggest gift the first like initial gift uh, that we gave to each other because we decided not really to give gifts to each other on Christmas Day was our dogs I don't know if you've seen my video, my last video or my video before that, where I just kind of explained where I had been and why I was, you know, away from YouTube for a while. Um, so we got two greyhounds. I will insert two pictures of them right now. Um, if you want to watch and look at an actual video of the dogs, I will link that video down below. Um, their names are Maisie and Nora. They're really, really cute. Really, really like them. We've had them for about three weeks now, a little bit more than three weeks. Yeah, I think so. But anyways, they're adjusting really well. They're very gentle, loving dogs. They are ex-racers, um, uh, so they did uh, grow up or yeah, race in Florida. So right now it's snowing here, so it's kind of funny. We took them out a few days ago when it first snowed, and they had never seen snow before, obviously. And they were just like jumping and bouncing. They didn't know what the heck it was. And it turns out they don't like snow, but when they first saw it, they were kind of excited. Um, but yeah, and another thing, and just another quick note, is I've actually created a Inst an Instagram account for the dogs because they're just, they're so photogenic, and I can just, like, I just keep taking pictures of them, so I figure I should share them with everyone. If you want to follow um, my dogs, I know it sounds kind of ridiculous, but they are really cute, you won't regret following them, um, the Instagram handle is at Maisie and Nora, I will leave it down, you know, on the screen and down below. So yeah, if you'd love to follow them, I'm sure they would really appreciate it. Um, yeah, so another gift that I got um, is actually from my husband's family. I got a lot of stuff from them, but a lot of it is just so big slash heavy that I didn't feel like bringing upstairs. This is, I guess you can't really see it, this is a scarf. So it's a nice light pastel peach. This is actually the same, pretty much the same shade as my wedding dress, and I think that's why they got it for me, because my wedding dress, the color just really suited my really fit, uh, pale complexion, so they thought that this would look nice on me, and it also, at the bottom, it's on the other side too, it has a brown Eiffel Tower, and then it says Paris, and it has stamps all over it, and I also, I'm obsessed with Paris, I went to France when I was 17, and I just loved it, and I would love to go again, and this is like the softest scarf ever, I wore that yesterday, and it just looked really nice, I really like it. Um, another thing that I got um, from my, actually from my sister-in-law, I got a nice, um, little cake pedestal. Uh, it's probably 12 inches in diameter and it's pale, pale pink. It's just, it's so cute. It's so girly. It's like got like scalloped edges around and it'll just be really nice to, you know, have um, cupcakes or cakes or muffins or, you know, baked goods just on display. So I'm really excited to use that. Another thing that I got that it was actually just a little bit too heavy for me to bring up was a big Dutch oven that I got. Um, it, what color is it? It's like a dark blue. It's definitely, it's more like a gray blue, if that makes sense. It's fairly big, and I've just, I've wanted one for quite a while. 
So they got me one of those. Um, we got gift certificates. We got tons and tons of chocolate. Um, I got a little soap dish. It has like two uh, birds on it right now. It's just in the bathroom. I forgot to pick it up. Um, and I also got another cute thing that I got. It was a big uh, glass. It's white. It's probably this big. It looks like a hunk of uh, or a slice of Swiss cheese. And then I got a little uh, knife with it. And it's just, you know, for a cheese platter because I am obsessed with cheese. So they got that for me. So that was really nice of them. So yeah, um, this was, I know I didn't show a lot of the actual gifts that I got. Um, but yeah, I didn't. I, I would have loved to have the dogs in this video. But I think, again, they're, they're adjusting. But I think they probably would have tried to eat the camera. Yesterday, one of the dogs ate the remote. So yeah, I don't think we're ready, really ready yet to introduce them to, you know, our expensive electronics yet. But yeah, hopefully, you know, those two pictures that I inserted in the video will suffice for now. I'm sure they will be in a video in the future. And again, follow them on Instagram if you want to see more of them. And I am completely rambling on. You're probably just like, Allison, like, just be quiet. Like, you're, you're, you're not making any more sense anymore. So I'm going to go. I hope everyone is having a fantastic day. Um, the holidays aren't over yet. Tomorrow is... Tomorrow? Yes, tomorrow is New Year's Eve. So that is really exciting. Tell me below if you're doing anything special. Um, my husband and I, we're probably not doing anything. We are probably just, you know, staying in our living room, watching TV and hanging out with the dogs. So, but that'll be fun. But anyways, I hope you guys have a fantastic day and a fantastic New Year's. And I will see you guys again later sometime. Hopefully next week. Okay, <laughs> bye. Hi guys, I hope everyone's having a fantastic day today. Today I have yet another empties video for you. I believe this might be my 10th video, I'm not sure though, but I've done quite a few of these. If you are interested in seeing any of my other empties videos, I do have a playlist that I will link 